What's up, guys? I hope you're all feeling good today. So I'm going to be honest with you. Um, I'm really tired right now, whether it's from a lack of sleep or from just working today and being on my feet the entire day. I, uh, I, I, I don't want to do this right now. So I thought I would be honest with you and just say uh, that I'm, I'm doing a challenge to upload videos every day. And yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm experiencing that challenge right now. <laughs> um, so... Uh, I'm going to make this short. Um, somebody did leave a comment on my video yesterday um, that I will respond to. It was a suggestion for a video. Um, so let's go ahead and get into that. Um, to, oh, by the way, to make things even worse, <laughs> um, today, one of those days where I spilled somebody else's coffee at work. Like, it was sitting right on the edge of uh, a, a workstation and... I just bumped into it and it knocked over and it spilled all over and I was just like, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. And so it it's one of those days, you know, and it's raining out. That doesn't really matter. The weather is the weather, but I mean, people always talk about rainy days being like, you know, whatever. So anyway, uh, the comment from a person with a username that's just the letter S. Um, I do appreciate having a really easy to read username. If you guys could all do me a favor and just change your usernames to to be a single letter or a single number, that that's good. I I, I don't like pronouncing people's usernames because I can never do it. I, I always say it wrong. But anyway, the the question was about um, making a video about basically getting motivated to do something that you need to do, uh, but you keep on postponing it because you're scared and anxious to do it. So this person also said, you always make me feel motivated. So obviously you're looking for a little bit of motivation um, <laughs> to, to do something that you're scared about or you're anxious about. And uh, uh, I'll do my best, but I'll say this, um, you're probably not going to get a lot of help from me right now. Um, really, I mean, if you think about it, like those fears and those negative thoughts that you and negative feelings that you have, those are yours. Those are yours to deal with, to overcome. Um, um, I mean, honestly, facing your fears, uh, things that make you uncomfortable, you know, those experiences make you a better person and um, they give you valuable life experience. And, you know, because I don't know exactly what it is that you're postponing and what the fear is, you know, sometimes we're afraid of things that are worth being afraid of because are, you know, like if something is actually going to negatively affect your life in the long term, if something is actually going to have a major negative consequence, then, 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 you know, you should actually take your time to, you know, it, it might be okay to postpone it. But if your fear is coming from a place of insecurity, if your fear is coming from a place of, you know, oh, what if something just happens that, I don't know that that I'm gonna that that I'm uncomfortable with. What if something happens? Like, like if it's not a major consequence, is what I'm saying. Then most likely the fear or the anxiety is coming from either a lack of confidence or a need or a desire for per perfectionism. Uh, that's usually what it is. Um, if it's if it's a situation where you're not doing it and you keep postponing it because you're playing things out in your head of how it's going to go over and over and over again. Just, you know, just thinking about everything that could go wrong. That is perfectionism. That is the, the desire for everything to work out perfectly and nothing go wrong. And Nothing in life is ever perfect. You know, like again, today I spilled coffee in the middle of the day and I just moved on from it. It was a small thing. I was embarrassed. I felt bad. I told the guy that I spilled the coffee that, you know, I was like, sorry, I apologized. You know, um, I should have bought him another coffee. I can still do that tomorrow or some other time. You know, I could, you know, make up for it. But, you know, um, mistakes happen. Mistakes are part of life. Mistakes are how we improve ourselves and learn. So I guess my point here is I have no idea what the situation is that you're afraid of. If it's something that you're trying to save yourself from a little bit of embarrassment, is it social anxiety or is it something that, hey, you know, 
you're scared because it could have a major impact on your life. Um, but if it's something to do with confidence, you need to trust yourself. You need to trust that you have the ability to handle anything that can go your way. And let's just say that it doesn't doesn't go the way you want it to. Let's just say that something bad happens or mistakes were made or everything that you were afraid of turns out to, to be true. So what? You know, I mean, really, like, what is that going to do? Like, what? what is the outcome going to be? You know, um, you can move on, you can try again, or you can make up for things that, that have gone wrong. There's always more time, you know, there's always more time for us to, you know, and that's the other thing is, I mean, there's not an unlimited amount of time. But the more you postpone something, the more you're gonna hate yourself for not doing it, you know, so would you rather um, do it and get it over with and deal with the consequences and just whatever? Or would you would you rather not do it and keep wishing that you did? So uh, again, I have no idea if this is a small thing or a big thing that you're postponing. But whatever it is, think about it in terms of perfectionism needing everything to be perfect and realize that nothing ever will be perfect. Nothing ever has been perfect in anybody's life ever. Um, there's always things that can go wrong. So you have to know that you're, you're good enough, that you can handle things, that you're smart enough, that you, you can deal with whatever comes your way. So, you know, don't give up before you even start, you know, don't, don't, don't not do it. Because something could go wrong. That's all I'm, I'm going to say. Um, I hope that you can deal with your whatever it is that you're scared about, whatever it is that you're anxious about. Again, I don't even know how this sounded. I'm tired right now. I'm just trying to make a video for the day and I appreciate your comment. If anybody else has any other comments for like, hey, Kenny, can you talk about this subject? I, I, I'll try. You know, I can't guarantee it. I will certainly, I'll be the judge of whether or not your idea is a good idea for a video, but I am so tired. I am going to record today's Wordle and then I am going to maybe take a nap. <laughs> like I am that tired. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Take care.